How much does a polar bear weigh? Enough to break the ice. Hi, my name's Cole. Hi, my name's Cole. If you know me, great. If you don't, you suck and should go die. Okay, I'm just kidding. Well, uh, my name's Cole. I'm 15 years old. I'm shooting on a Canon 50mm lens. And uh, yeah, I use Final Cut to do my editing. And yeah, that's all you really need to know about me. Interesting fact, I am a three-sport player. I'm somewhat of what you call a jock, you know, ping pong, bowling, a little croqueting now and then, you know, do, do a little billiards, you know, just to get the blood pumping. So yeah, that's just a little bit about myself. And uh, my character is called Paul Lacoste. He's a newspaper reporter. And uh, so what we're gonna do is I'm gonna show off my character and him going around at a school trying to find drugs in kids' lockers. So, have a little fun with that. Hello and welcome to WGFH News. I'm your anchor white news guy number 38, here with today's top story. Some suspicious people were reported doing something stupid with flashlights on the street. A deputy reported that they were not suspicious, merely Canadian and enjoying an evening stroll. Now over to Paula Cost at Kingsport Kids for Knowledge in Harlem for today's special report. Thanks. We're here on location in a rich white kid's school to see how many drugs we can find in their lockers. So remember, no lockers have been opened before, so this is going to be as big a surprise as me as to you. Okay, let's open this first one. There's no drugs! Crap! In other news, a suspicious coin was found at Kingsport Mall. An officer called onto the scene reported it was a quarter. Now back to you, Paul. Okay, we're only gonna do this one more time. If this locker does not have any drugs in it, then I am going to quit my job! Okay, 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 here we go, here we go, here we go. Crap! There's no drugs in it! Dude, oh there's like God. a gun and a noose in there. No, no, there's no drugs! That's not fucking drugs! There's a gun in there! That's drugs! Dude, get him! Get him! Oh. Alright, I'll let this on YouTube. Alright, here's what you do. With whenever you're going up on a mugger or a pothead, here's what you first do. First, you get wrist control. You see, now I can move him around. Pretty good, right? Alright, secondly, you pull out your gun. It is very important that you pull out your gun. Yeah.